In this section, we show that the unit and co-unit of adjoint situations enjoy universal mapping properties. Throughout this section, G and F will be functors. The universal mapping property of the unit at a B object B occurs in the category of B over G. This category has B morphisms, F from B to G A as objects, and we denote this by A comma F, and morphisms from F to F prime as commuting triangles, and we denote this by the amorphism H. Note that the category of object B over G is the fiber category over the object B of the forgetful functor from category B over G to B cross A followed by the projection to the category B, indicated as a one pullback in the diagram. So given a functor F and an A object A, we can define F over A as the fiber category of the analogous functor over that object A. You can verify that the objects and morphisms of this category are what you'd expect, similar to the category of B over G. We now come to the main result of this section. Let FG be in a joint situation, then 1 for each B object B. A to B is the initial object in B over G, and 2 for each A object A. Epsilon A is the terminal object in F over A. To prove 1, we claim that given some B over G object F, then there exists a unique amorphism given by epsilon a f f, such that a to b followed by g on epsilon a f f is f. In other words, we want to show that the diagram commutes, and moreover, the amorphism epsilon a f f is unique. Recall that a joint situation induces the following isomorphism between HOM sets for each pair of objects a and b. It is defined by taking amorphism g to the composition g g a to b. Therefore, epsilon a f f must be unique. Indeed, if the diagram on the left commutes and h is another morphism which makes the diagram commute, h and epsilon a f f have the same value under the above isomorphism. But an isomorphism of sets is injective and hence h is equal to epsilon a f f. So we only need to show the commutativity. We have g on epsilon a f f a to b is equal to g epsilon a g f f a to b, and we use naturality of the unit a to to make the substitution of a to g a f for g f f a to b. But g epsilon a a to g a is equal to the identity on g a by the triangle identity of the joint situation, and so it is equal to f. Therefore, a to b is the initial object in b over g. For the co-unit, the argument is completely analogous and we will skip it. You can pause the video to follow the arguments if you'd like. And that completes the proof.